On February 8, 2024, the Spanish Army Procurement Board launched a tender for a framework agreement aimed at acquiring 40 by 53 m grenades for LAG-40 and MK-19, with a total budget exceeding 15 million euros. This initiative, set to run for two years, replaces the previous agreement from 2020, which had a four-year duration and a budget of just under 6 million euros, as well as the 2017 agreement, lasting three years with a budget of 3.8 million euros. The increased funding is largely attributed to insights gained from the conflict in Ukraine, suggesting that existing stockpiles and arsenals would be depleted within a few hours under the intensity of battles seen in the European theater. The tender consists of three separate lots. The first lot focuses on 40 by 53 m high explosive, he, grenades, with a budget of 5,361,856.67 euros. The second lot is for 40 by 53 m high explosive dual purpose, HEDP, grenades, allocated 8 million euros. Lastly, the third lot is designated for 40 by 53 m tracer exercise, TPT, grenades, with a budget of 1.6 million euros. The contract, awarded by the Army Contracting Board, revolves around the procurement of 40 by 53 m grenades for LAG-40 and MK-1940 mm automatic grenade launchers, with a total value of 15,036,670 euros. This contract, executed under standardized regulations, encompasses three distinct lots. Lot 1 involves the acquisition of 40 by 53 mm he grenades, valued at approximately 5,361,856.67 euros. Lot 2 focuses on 40 by 53 mm perforating head grenades, with an estimated value of 8,017,656.67 euros, and a similar execution site. Lot 3 pertains to the acquisition of 40 by 53 mm tracer TPT exercise grenades, with an estimated value of 1,657,000 156.66 euros. This reinforcement of the Spanish army's capabilities aligns with a broader trend in Europe aimed at bolstering military readiness, as evidenced by initiatives across almost every European country, and underscored by the 2023 EU Capability Development Priorities document. This document reflects the European Union's commitment to addressing the pressing ammunition needs highlighted by the ongoing conflict in Ukraine. The EU's strategic reassessment, as reflected in the revision of the Capability Development Plan, CDP, demonstrates an adaptation to the evolving security landscape. The European Union has taken significant measures to address the urgent ammunition requirements amidst the ongoing conflict in Ukraine. This document outlines the outcomes of the CDP revision, reflecting changes in the EU's strategic environment, political guidance from the strategic compass, and lessons learned from Russia's aggression against Ukraine. As a result, a revised set of capability development priorities has been established, serving as the central reference for EU-wide defense planning and the foundation for defense-related initiatives and instruments such as the Coordinated Annual Review on Defense, CARD, Permanent Structured Cooperation, PESCO, European Defense Fund, EDF, and any future EU defense support tools. Since 2008, the European Defense Agency has regularly updated its CDP in collaboration with member states and with input from the EU Military Committee and EU Military Staff. The 2023 review identified 14 priorities across five military domains, along with eight more under strategic enablers and force multipliers. In addressing ammunition needs, priorities include ensuring adequate stockpiles of large-caliber ammunition, weapons, and equipment with enhanced lethality and accuracy, soldier mobility improvement through lighter individual equipment, and the development of non-lethal engagement tactics. Other priorities involve upgrading air defense systems, including C-RAM, man pads, and very short-range and medium-range air defense systems, as well as enhancing operational readiness through shared stocks and common warehousing. Standardization and interoperability of consumables and spare parts exchangeability also feature prominently in the priorities.